check my fist. Hello, hello. Check, check, hello. Okay, happy Sabbath, everyone. Sabbath. Are we recording? Okay, let's pray one more time. Our Father in heaven, we thank you for this Sabbath. We ask that you forgive us from our sins. Give us wisdom and understanding to absorb your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay. Ang topic po natin ngayong umaga ay tungkol sa banal na espiritu. Ito po, this is, do you understand Tagalog, ma? Are you sure? Okay. Do you understand uh, English? Okay, we will mix. But it's there. Okay. The Holy Spirit is one of my favorite topics. Man. It says here in Romans 8, For I am not persuaded, for I am persuaded that neither death nor life nor angels nor principalities nor things, nor powers nor things present, nor things to come, nor height nor death, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God. Amen? Okay, we will skip all the songs. There is a story of Gao Hong Chi. Gao Hong Chi cannot read. Gao Hong Chi cannot remember. <laughs> Imagine, you cannot read illiterate. And even if somebody tells you, you cannot remember what they told you. So he comes to church, but if you ask him, what did you hear? He cannot remember every, anything. <clears throat> How can, but he wants to be a witness. Yeah? How can you be a witness if you cannot read, you cannot remember? So he spent hours praying, long, long hours praying. I think four hours. It was in the book, but I don't remember also. <laughs> and <clears throat> after plenty of prayer, he, he, prayer and fasting, he opened the Bible and he was able to read one chapter. And he ran to his pastor. He said, Pastor, I, I read, I, I prayed, and God helped me read. And then I will recite to you. And he recited that chapter. And then for the first year since he prayed and he fasted, many he prayed many hours, he told that testimony and read the Bible and recited the Bible to men, to everyone. Imagine you cannot read, you cannot uh, remember, and then suddenly you can read. You know what he did? He wants to witness. He told everybody he can meet about what he read in the Bible. On the first year, he brought 180 people to the church. Amen? Wow! That's the power of the Holy Spirit. That's what our brother read a while ago, and I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you when? Until when? Forever. Praise the Lord. The Holy Spirit is the comforter to comfort us. Even the spirit of truth. Who explains the truth? The Holy Spirit. Who helps understand the truth? The Holy Spirit. Yeah, that's why we, before we open Bible and try to study, we ask for the guidance of the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit gives us ideas, helps us understand things that are of the Spirit. Okay. Whom the word, world cannot receive because it seeth him not. You know why some people don't understand things that we understand? Even because they don't receive. But we know Him, for He dwelleth in you. The Holy Spirit dwells in us. We are the temple of the Holy Spirit, and He shall be in you. And behold, I send you the promise of my Father. Wow! When God promises, it will happen. Right? God is not liar. But tarry ye in the city in Jerusalem until ye are in Jude with power. Then, before we go to evangelism, we wait for the Holy Spirit. What happened? Then that same evening, uh, same day in the evening, the doors were shut, the disciples were assembled, for fear of the Jews came Jesus and stood in the midst, yeah, and peace be unto you, and he said, he, he showed them his hands and his height, then they were disciples, the disciples were glad when they saw the Lord, then he said to them, peace be unto you, as my father has sent, and he said, he breathed on them, and said unto them, receive ye the Holy Ghost, wow, it is Jesus who gave the Holy Spirit before he left. But when the Comforter is come, I will send you the Father, uh, I will send unto you from the Father, even the Spirit of Truth, which proceeded from the Father. 
and he shall testify of who is the, the spirit talking about it is jesus is this jesus is the message the center of the message and ye, where is the holy spirit come from the father now according to that verse and ye shall also bear witness wow we have something to do what we heard what we listened to what we read we bear witness because ye have been with me from the beginning that's what happened with the disciples <clears throat> how be it the spirit of truth is come he will guide you into all truth. Who teach you how to play? Who gave her the gift of the Spirit to play? Holy Spirit. Who gave, if you know how to read, who gave you, who teach you how